morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are in this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers, my name is Didi. Today, on this beautiful Friday, the 3rd of September, cool, short TA video about Bitcoin, two charts I will need to show you because I really like what I see. Yes, buy Bitcoins, buy banks, beautiful hollow cap, and let's jump into the first beautiful TA chart guys, TA chart, what a stupid. Let's jump into the first really cool chart. Bam! Cause the devil was on my trail. I've been running so long that my feet don't work no more. Oh yeah. I've been running so long. Over here. Um, in this chart, we see the four hour chart of Bitcoin. Yes, this is the Aura platform. If you want to join that platform, click the link down below the video. Um, <clears throat> you can see that the Bam Bam indicator told us to short over there, but that was the selling of the long that we made over there. Uh, do we take the short now? No, we will take the short when we close the candle down below the yellow stepping line. When this one is completely yellow or blue, and when the bam bam crossed that one that is when we take the short but let's quickly jump into these charts that i want to show you because something really cool is showing and uh, first of all this chart we have been looking at that one for some time you see that we found support on that red line that is exactly what we expected and we are now expecting it to go to the purple line over there 63k to break that previous all-time high earlier this year okay that is also on track but now let's take a look at this one over here <clears throat> this is a weekly chart uh, every candle is a week mm. the beautiful part of this um, chart is the bottom that is the rsi and the yellow line that one is the 60 level and i think it's an important level in the rsi because if you look back for example here to the 2017 bull run when we came above that 60 level we stayed above it for many months you see many months maybe I need to draw it so you see it over here guys we stayed above that 60 level for many months till we broke it and when we broke that 60 level that was the start of the bear market now we see the same thing again <clears throat> we now came above that 60 level if we will now copy what we saw in 2017 or in 2014, we will see that our ZI even going up to 90 a few times before we break down again. <clears throat> and then when we break down, don't look at the time. I'm just drawing like a loosely head. I so said it's like not October 2022 when I think that the bear market will start. But this is what I expect that we go above 60 even up to the 90 level and then stay above it for a couple of months couple of months around 120 days till december this year where we again will see the peak in my opinion and then a peak above 100k maybe even above 160k um, like plan b or 280k um, like his extended model but that is very important to look at i think at the weekly chart is that if we come above the 60 level and we stay above it that makes fireworks guys really cool now let's jump into two more really important charts of today yes i'm keeping it short and uh, bam over here i saw this tweet hmm. why it's important to understand and the importance of bitcoin storing your wealth in bitcoin as a store of value because if you look at bitcoin then in over a year the average price of a single family house in england is up at 13 percent in british pounds in bitcoin if you calculate the price in bitcoin it's down by 71 percent so if you would have left your money as fiat on a bank you would have been paying 30 percent more 13 percent more for your house instead of that if you would have held your money in bitcoins your own bank you would have now saved 70 percent on that same house instead of 45 bitcoins you have been now paying 13 bitcoins and that is exactly what you see in this um, beautiful graph you can see the blue one that is the price if you would have kept your money in pounds 
and the yellow line that is the line of the price if you would have kept your money in bitcoins so instead of 45 bitcoins you would now be paying 13 14 bitcoins and in pounds instead of 390,000 pounds you would have now been paying 440,000 pounds that is what happens when you store your capital your wealth in bitcoin now let's jump into the next chart over here oh my god did he bam also really awesome to see the top 10 since 2013 um, which coins were in the top 10 a lot of them were in the top 10 but bitcoin has been in the top all the time ethereum has been in the top almost all the time litecoin has been in the top almost all the time if you look at this chart you can see which ones left the top 10 these are the red ones and the blue ones are uh, the ones that gained their place back in the top 10. so now the top 10 bitcoin ethereum cardano binance tether ripple dogecoin solana usd and polkadot really cool top 10 for this year but like you can see and that is the only thing i want to show you by showing you this is it is very important um, to understand that bam i'm back over here yes there's many currencies yes you can invest in all of them to make some more profits or accumulate more bitcoins but always remember that the top 10 has been shifting every year again and then again and again so it doesn't mean that all those currencies that are hyping now will stay in the top 10 you just saw which coins stayed in the top 10 already for many years i saw bitcoin i saw ethereum I saw the Cardano, I saw Litecoin. So that is why it is very important to diversify your portfolio. Yes, take some profits in those altcoins, but yes, hedge them in the coins that has been there for 10 years or longer and always is in the top 10. That is why I have all our capital, all our store of value in Bitcoin because of this combination. It is growing tremendously year after year. Everything in life becomes cheaper now for me because I'm stored in Bitcoin instead of becoming more expensive because I would have had it on the banks. That is why I'm wearing a t-shirt today. Buy Bitcoin, buy banks. Yes, that was everything for today. I know it's a short video, uh, but I'm still recovering a little bit from that thing that everybody is talking about, but I'm doing pretty fine. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell and leave a comment. What do you think about the charts? What do you think about storing your value in Bitcoin instead of fiat? Uh, just let me know down below. Comment, 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 thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And yes, if you want to have the t-shirt, it's available in our store at thebitcoinfamily.com. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow again. I wish you an amazing Friday, an amazing weekend. Uh, yes, probably we'll do some lives Saturday and Sunday in Dutch and English to uh, talk about what um, I experienced in the last week. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again. Bam! You better pray much more.